all right what's good youtube we are not live on twitch just yet doing the intros beforehand but we're going to be revisiting a video reattempting it uh last video wasn't good for a lot of reasons but this video will be a b team video now what does that mean this means that i will be putting players at each position and their respective primaries on whom i would use if the options that i had currently on my god squad weren't available so that being said you're gonna see some repeats some guys from the bench and some actual starters being in this lineup and i'll explain what that means honus wagner will be leading off at shortstop now i get it it's big honus play second base on the god squad but that's him playing second base truth is if tatis didn't exist he would be my shortstop so he will be there in his primary second base gavin lux narrowly beating out hornsby i just mashed so well with that card that i have to take advantage of that diamond defense and that 80 speed I just have to he's such a great card i love it probably one of the best free cards we've ever gotten definitely one of the, the best definitely the best card in the pennant race pack now third willie mays who's not even on the bench or the starting squad on the god squad so he will be third in center field hit or miss either homers a bunch of times and hits and goes four for four or can't touch the baseball worse shit so in the fourth spot juan soto prestige juan uh bench player so i get it but never sees the field really and only comes in every other game for a pinch hit opportunity and does his job we don't start him because of that fielding simple as that Fielding in the speed is tough. Manny Machado, who is now a recent bench addition in the five spot and the th at third base. Slow as all hell, but that offense, these numbers, and that fielding, man, it's just too much to pass up on. So he'll be at third base in his primary. In right field, big Cody B. He is a freak. He's really, really good. One of the glitchiest cards in the game. Now, it, I'm not particularly great with him, but I'm still pretty decent, so we can get some value out of him in his primary. He would be in right field if Griffey didn't exist seventh spot one of my personal favorite cards heidemar candelario gold fielder prestige 102 90 versus righties 125 one away versus lefties this card matches i enjoy his swing a lot and i do particularly well with him so we'll keep him there in the eighth spot jt riomuto who will be working on his prestige very very soon love this card everything about it oh everything about this card except for that contact versus righties but we'll make it work on the bump interesting pick 98 luis severino Decent hits through nine, decent K through nine, good stamina, and throws pretty hard, and he's got a cutter. Uh, never used this card. Would he be in my next top five? I have a five rotation, basically like an eight-man rotation. Would he be in the top 10 or 12 if there was more spots available? Maybe, maybe not, but never used him. He's a solid option, and he's got full stamina, so we'll give him a shot. Now, bullpen. Matzik, Anderson, Garrett Crochet, Dennis Eckersley wade davis josh Hader, and liam hendricks all guys that you've seen before on squads um that would be in my rotation uh if all those other guys in my starting rotation or bullpen i should say died in a horrible fiery <clears throat> anyways so if you guys are hyped for this video like the video comment down below and subscribe to the channel and do not forget to put that bell on so you don't miss when i post which is every day at noon eastern wait a minute the bench Stan Musial Prestige. Love this card, and he's barely missing out on being on the bench in the main squad. Jim Tomei, one of the best righty killers in the entire game. Phenomenal swing. J-Ram Prestige on the bench. Versatility. I want this card to be good, and I have a feeling next year he will be. Nicholas Castellanos, uh, one of the top overall cards you can get in terms of versatility with a great swing and good attributes combined. And Breggy as the lefty killer as well. A um, little bit weak versus righties, but he'll mash lefties, so he'll be on the bench, off the bench in that situation. Now... Like I said, guys, before, like, comment, subscribe. It really helps me out. Boosts our content in the algorithm on YouTube, which is fantastic. Um, but other than that, enjoy the video, guys. We're going to hop into a game. Ha! Gavin? Nothing like starting the day off right. Out! Got to roll over. Big Han, Big Han. Oh, yeah, he was, dude, he was totally sold out on four seam. I should have just went back to it. Wouldn't be a MLB The Show, but lunge swing didn't lead to a homer. Damn, I got shit on. My pretty little go. Away. Go. All right. Well, only one run. Big Gavin hits it perfectly, and it goes foul. Nice. I love that new, that new thing that's happening where it curves. And yeah, it's followed up with two smash baseballs for outs. Nice. Out. Missed it. Willie has the longest swing on the fucking planet. <laughs> Wait. How does swing? Dot. Hey. He's adjusted. 
We must revisit our game plan. Yeah, good cut, Willy. Yep, that's how you get hits, baby. Just do that. Oh my god. A second perfect out? Another one in two innings? That's a hit, though. Maze over Griffey, yes. Yo, epic. Thank you, man. I appreciate that. Wait a minute. Oh, how many times am I going to get scanned? Yes, this is where you shine. By fluking your opponents are all hell. That's what I, I, I earned that. I have two perfect outs hey, and a good fly it. out. No chance, no chance. Oh, what a great swing, bro. Oh, what a great swing. Jaimer, Jaimer, get there, baby. Oh, no, he's out. There's our top five swing in the game, baby. <laughs> what a spot, Manuel. Oh, that was a great inning. Love that. Willie, I swung early. That should be a homer. Am I playing the game right? Oh, get in him. Get in him. Enter him. Yeah, he was. He, I, I feel like he was ready out, like for that, but it was just. Dotted. He's out. That's ball four. This should be an easy out. Money, money. Give me that. Try hard, Chev. W. Yes, Manny. Yes. What a swing. That's a run. Horrible route. Let's go, Manny. Tom and Jerry type beef. Okay. This is your champion, Jep. All right. Well, okay. All right. Those are three dots, by the way. That last one just got shitted on. Oh my God. That's two elite PCIs from Savvy. You know, one time I just hope that I could foul a pitch off when I have a bad swing and it doesn't just go immediately straight up in the air, but it always fucking does, so. It's not Lord Seeger anymore. It's, um, what was it? What we decided it was? Oh my God, bro. There you go. How many more times do I gotta strike him out? Oh, wow. Who knew that was coming? guy severino couldn't throw a pitch in the zone and then i get him to strike out and they're like nope here you go Give me this. Dub. and yes great swing on a good pitch that's a great swing oh my god i'm cracked right now I feel so comfortable with Willie against lefties and horribly uncomfortable versus righties. And that was a good swing. Okay, so that was the worst pitching through the entire at bat, and it was He's still out. pretty good. And that was a good swing. Manny with another hit. Manny's on fire. A perfect, perfect out, and then two hits. Another base hit. Bail me. Swing early with Cody Bellinger, and he'll literally never get out. Didn't expect the 2-0 mid change up. That just threw me off. Another dot, man. He's hitting spots. That's a perfect sinker, bro. I gotta give this guy credit, man. He's dotting. Is that good enough to go? In the PCI. Nope. Too far out of the zone. Another good pitch. Oh, my God. Dot. Pona's only rakes for me when he plays second base. Especially the last three innings. Like, look at that shit, dude. Absolute sequence, man. Up the middle. Let's go. Honus doing Honus things. All I need him to do is get on base up the middle, and he'll he'll be a catalyst. Well, that's, that's this is what Honus does, man. 
Beautiful swing. Not again. Not Gavin's second perfect, perfect line out, dude. No chance, right? Oh my god, man. That's like... Uh, Caps, we need to keep a counter, bro. That's 12 in the last two days. Says Rickety oh, one shit. new Omis. That is naughty. Bro, Willie Mace, what's good? Late? I swung so early. Home run. Nope. Sure-handed Manny. I think I'm going to say this, guys, and I think I'm accurate. Oh. I think Manny Machado is the best defensive third baseman we've ever seen in the show. Of course, he gets better at third. No bias, no cat. Yeah, absolutely. Home run. Great swing. I think he might have missed it with the PCI, though. Or he got scammed. All right, Juan. Larry Walker's the worst diamond fielder this year. You might be right, man. Um, but right field in general gets really bad animations. They honestly fall over way too much. All right, this is your better side, Juan, technically. Boom. I was wondering why Juan Soto was better reverse one and, one. and I looked at his stats from last year, and he annihilated lefties. Like, it was abuse. Like, you guys should go, If you have a second, go to base. Are they going to bail me out? 125, that's what it should do. Uh, metrics. They robbed Belly. Finally. Oh, that was an elite PCI and a top five pimp job. Oh my God. He hit that so hard. My gold fielder just shit his pants. the team because now they can just live under the radar Ooh, and not be forced to spend money for the rest of their career as a franchise who was this jacob stallings for ken griffey he sat on it and he went deep with jacob stallings Always, I'm always dominating these games, and then I, I, they tie it or get close to tying it late in the game for perfects. Great swing. Thank you. Thank you. Fielder. No, I bailed him. Oh, no, I moved him. Got him. Oh. I fucked that hole that bad up. That's a fantastic swing. I swung early. It's going to fade back into his into him, though. You know, what's crazy about that swing, right, guys, is, like, that shouldn't be a hit, in my opinion. Most of the time, it shouldn't be a hit. If anything, it should fluke over the shortstop's head. But the sad reality is that pitch, right, that pitch has been a home run a lot this year. A little, I got him a little bit late side of good. That was a great hack. That might have been his bad stats versus lefties or bad attributes. Oh, and GG's. Let's go, baby. B team finishes out. out and gets a dub. Tons of great swings this game. A lot of perfect outs, man. Um, but overall, a pretty clean game. I'm not going to lie. The runs high opponent scored, man. Um, they were on great swings. Jacob Stallings with a huge homer for him. Um, that came off the bench and hit a three run yak piece off Garrett Crochet. Luis Severino, four earned runs, but I feel like that doesn't tell the story. I feel like he was much more dominant than that. He allowed six hits, two of them being in the last inning he pitched, and three of those four earned runs coming literally in the last. No, two of those three, four runs coming in the last inning he pitched. Only one walk, and really shouldn't have walked him. But regardless, play of the games, Cody B, three for four. Soto, three for four as well. Willie Mays homered, and Jaime Candelario also did the damn thing. If you guys enjoyed this video, man, smash that like button. Really helps out. Um, puts us in the algorithm. Comment down below. Tell me what you guys want to see next. You know, I'm always looking for ideas. The most liked comment or some of the most liked comments or anything I respond to, you'll know you'll see it in the video. And subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to put that bell on so you don't miss when I post every day at noon Eastern. We're full time April 16th, guys. So be on the lookout for tons of content. You don't want to miss it on the channel. Until then, I'm out this bitch. Bye.